Well, the vehicle is not registered. So, what the hell is well, this? Well, that's what a lot of people do. What the f***? Hey, buddy, put your hands against what the desk and find your back. Can I come who we had entertainment earlier relating to the All shooting? Right, dude. Not the one that we just had a vanilla unit ago, but the one who was actually on site at the FBI building. What are you asking? I want to know who he is, because I potentially want to track him down so I can get a good look at him, because I've had a couple of look at CCTV now. Well, he's a whiskey mic with white shoes, black pants, a black hoodie with a little red and white tie. Oh, this regard looks. Didn't you guys release him? I did. I most certainly did not release him. He would have been still in detention if it was up to me. 3315, I'm going to be on scene of what has been crashed like going to be. How's it going? 849. Hey, no, um, I'm alright. Do you have your driver's license, registration, proof of insurance? Yes. Can you tell me what I got pulled over for? I will absolutely tell you the reason why you're stopped uh, as soon as I get your information, ma'am. Thank you, Miss Brunswick. So I'm Officer yeah, Cortland with the Los Angeles Police Department. The reason why I'm stopping you is when you when you made that right-hand turn on a Davis Avenue, you didn't come to a complete stop. You kind of blew the light. And then when you were uh, coming up here to turn right onto Carson, you actually made a uh, legal turn and you went straight from that turn lane. So that was a uh, right only lane, and you went straight. That is the only reason why I'm stopping you. Oh yes, cause I don't, I don't, I don't usually go down here, so I don't really know the street like that. Gotcha. I don't need to come get some gas because I'm about to run out. Understandable. So I was just trying to find my way to the gas I'm so sorry. Nah, you're good. All right, just sit tight and I'll be right back with you, okay? Hey, it's MIPD here. Just want to stop and say, if you're enjoying the content, it would be appreciated if you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It means so much to me seeing you guys enjoy the content I produce. It would be more by liking and subscribing and hitting the bell to get notified of my recent uploads. Now, enough of me rambling. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of the video. 183 I'll be traffic on a white Honda Odyssey. It's 856 Davis. Uh, Kathy Brunswick be a valid driver's license. She has a vehicle registration. Uh, except that's not her car. So what is that car? That is ninety-seven William Henry Queen eight nine one. 97, we'll get one between 91, or 891. Well, the vehicle is not registered. So, looks like she's going to be getting a citation. Actually, let me ask her real fast to see, uh... Hey, uh, Miss Brunswick. Yeah. Who is the vehicle registered to? You should be registered under Kathy Brown. Well, there is nothing on file that uh, shows that, so. I don't know if the the DMV screwed up there, but. Uh, it might have because I didn't register in the area. Gotcha. Like, I, I, I used to be from me to register. A male on a moped wearing a shirt. Well, oh, I thought he would have registered. 
Okay, that's who my phone tells me. Understandable. All right. Well, let me let me do this then. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna write you uh, the citation for the uh, for the failure to register the vehicle. I'm not gonna tow your car, but all you gotta but I'm gonna what I'm gonna have you do is just go to the court um, on the day that you're supposed to or pay it online or whatever. Um, go to the courthouse and say, listen, I had the vehicle registered at the time of the traffic stop. The, it, it looks like it never went through the system. Here's that paperwork, and they most likely will dismiss it. All right. But unfortunately, I can't. Unfortunately, we have a lot of drivers in the state of San Andreas that don't register their cars. So I'm just going to cite you it, and then you can just go to court and say, hey, it's registered. So, all right. Yeah, I'll just have to know when you need to register if you didn't go through. Gotcha. Alright, just sit tight on bear back view. Alright. So, I'm not gonna play the, uh... Went under the, bridge. The, the card that, uh... She forgot to register it in the system, because... All, everything she just said was out of RP. So, um... What I'm gonna do is... Write her a citation for... The failure to register. It's a Honda. Did I spell? I don't even know. I think I, I think I spelled it right. No, I didn't. Odyssey it is white, and I believe it's a 2020, but I I couldn't tell. So failure to um. Operating an unregistered okay. vehicle, so that's what we'll get her for. Um, let me just put this through. Be right turn on Center Street. Uh, Miss Brunswick. You know you're not supposed to get out of the vehicle while on a traffic stop, correct? So next time, can we stay in the vehicle when uh, we're on a traffic stop? Oh yes, I'm so sorry. I just need to I understand that, but you can shut the vehicle off and wait. Okay, you can't step out of the vehicle because it, uh, it actually puts a safety on us. All right. Okay, I'm so sorry. All right, but uh, at this time, you're being cited. Like I said, operating an unregistered vehicle. Um, it is an infraction. Um, like I said, like I mentioned, because your vehicle is unregistered, but you you claim that it is registered under the San Andreas DMV. Um, all you gotta do is show up to the courthouse and be like, listen, uh, this vehicle was registered when, um, when I was pulled over, not sure why I was in the system, as long as that status is valid in the DMV system, um, the courthouse will dismiss it. I'm also, um, giving you written warnings for, uh, the reason why I stopped you, which was the failure to obey traffic control device and failure to maintain your lane, alright? Yes, that's understandable, honey. All right, so I just need your signature at the bottom of this uh, this one citation. It's not a mission of guilt, just saying you're taking care of it in court, all right? All right. All righty, so here's the copy of your citation, um, along with your written warnings and your information back. Um, just make sure you uh you pay attention while you're driving a lot of drivers don't pay attention and uh, that's why accidents happen so just make sure you're you're paying attention wherever you're going so that you don't cut somebody off or cause an accident all right of course thank you so much no problem ma'am you have a good rest of your night drive safe you too, one day with three my truck's gonna be clear tonight I'll be in route to latest. Santorium, get six in the area of the uh, reckless mobile. Alright, we're in route to a possible stolen vehicle. Jesus, AI. I got the moped here. He's gonna be 753, gonna be on Strawberry Southbound. Scene. 
So let's start the uh, process here. Um. Speaks. Local caller at four six four West Eclipse for information on the stolen pickup. Uh, he was seen by a life invader. He's in a pickup that says. McKenna 96, I got him again. He's running circles here on Big Strawberry. 757. So We're back on the Sunday. FBI thing. 757. Taking right. a right hand turn here to the, uh, the yellow way, another left hand turn. I've just been. Can I find a charger? Nice. Uh. Postals and street. What was the vehicle? Got him here again. Reese on San Andreas Ave. 760 coming over the bridge. Orange and black hey, Harley friend. edition pickup. Okay. You were trying to head in the chest area. Hey, we got a postal. Was uh, what was the head description? All right, plate is twenty one diva nine two five. Uh, that is not what I want. I want my notepad. Twenty one dva nine two five. Stolen. Investigation in me. black. Harvey pickup. That's oh, Harley. Harley pickup. Big DI seven. Uh, what's, what's the head description? Male wearing all white with a cowboy hat. Um, suspect. White male. It's gonna be a male wearing all white with a cowboy hat uh, that fired at the officer. One every three. I think that's my mail for the stolen pickup. Nope. <laughs> I had to. I had to shut that down immediately. The pickup Big D seven is pick up Big D seven driven. Cowboy hat. It's gonna be a pickup at the play Bravo Ida George David 117. Here's the white male driving with a cowboy hat, white in color. Monster truck, correct. Got the moped. 762 Center Street. Making a right, Adams Apple, he's pulling over. 754, final stop. What's the subject? Moped. Taking off again. Shots fired, shots fired! 0315, I believe we have an off down, off down. Panic unit, 1880. I don't know what this officer thinks he's doing, but uh, I'm trying to get information from East this guy who stole this pickup, right and he keeps the conflicting square. the freaking sus my Michael, suspect Michael. as the person who shot this officer. So, the 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 one before him, the one before the one that just got shot now. 
Okay. There's the caller at 464. Describe. There's the caller at 464. Describe how the pickup. I got him right here. So I just tracked a truck. It's at 627. Alright, we're going to be in route to 627. I hit him off the goddamn bike. Sadie opened it and put it on the trailer. Okay. I click it at five. I mean, more units, more units. 633 individual to shot an officer with the cowboy hat is located. Or be, I mean, your units, please. I don't know. I don't know what they're talking about. Can that LSP unit cut his iron? Hey, bud. I'm gonna go five. Gonna go radio check, please. Let me talk to you here. So, uh, sorry. Sorry. are you selling these cars? Yeah, sorry, mate. Get you loud nope. and clear. Oh, We're currently tied up. You're on repoing them, okay? If you haven't been paying attention to the radio, because I have somebody that says uh, you stole their car. No, he just didn't pay his bills for the modification, so the dude told me to go repo it. I got paid to go repo it. Now I'm thinking the bank's the us. Gotcha. Do you have the paperwork for this uh, repo? Hold on, let me All right, let me read through it here. Thank you. The dude name is Marcus Jones. It's for both of these trucks. Okay, so Marcus owns both of them, or just the the Harley one back there? I don't know what you said. You uh, you, you cut out there. I said both of them. Okay, both of them. Yeah, because he, uh, he, he called and said that uh, the vehicle was, was stolen. So, what the hell is well, this? Well, that's what a lot of people do. What the fuck? Hey, buddy, put your hands against what the dash, put your hands behind your back. What are you, Whoa, what? 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 Being what? For what? Wait, I'm Suspicion of murder. A murder? Um, How? Yep. Sit tight How? real quick. I've just been repoing cars. You, you're fuck? under arrest for a suspicion of murder, sir. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you do what? say can and will be used against you in the call of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can afford that attorney, uh, one will be invited to you free charge by the state of San Andreas. You have what? the right to have that attorney when you're street questioning. Do you understand those rights? What the fuck? Bro, I twi know, approximately yeah. 20 minutes ago, there was an officer involved shooting involving a vehicle I that matches this description, interact. including an individual who matches your description. I have now just recently no. confirmed the plate of your yeah, vehicle see. is directly at that scene. No, so you're currently no, under arrest, suspicion no, of murder. No, 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 no. You know, yeah, I got the no, no, First of all, we have the wrong person. Second yeah, of all, you if you check if you check Skybox, the one officer conflicted uh, this guy with the moped. No, because I was investigating. I was investigating him. The description for me because I made 911 saying that I stole the truck, which I really didn't because I repoed it. And the dumbass cop took the GME and ran with my description, and I was giving that to him and the GME. Uh, so, yeah, I got that description. I ain't do shit. That's what came up on radio. How come that wasn't on guns? I'm, I'm pretty sure I said over the air that we have the wrong guy. I said it like. That was when the, when the moped pursuit was going on? Yeah, because mm -hmm. when the moped pursuit was going on, I, think I heard uh, this vehicle's plate and this guy's description is the guy that shot the officer. And I said, nope, that is not the guy. And How this is where that? we are. Because I was investigating him possibly stealing a car. So you were constantly with him for the entire thing? I was in constant contact with the caller who said that he stole his truck. You were constantly in contact with the caller or with him himself? I was not hit with him, but I passed him uh, on what road was that actually? Let me see here. It was up there by the Life Invader. 
uh, Mad Wayne Thunder Drive. I passed him specifically. I passed his truck towing these two cars uh, before I arrived on scene. Alright, uh, so can you just come back to my vehicle and can you confirm the roads that you drove down? I'm gonna check CCTV, make sure you run those roads. What? Um, I don't, so, so I don't remember I, So this is, this is my job. Just general area you were, I'll see if I can get CCTV to track you. This is my job, so Where's I have to follow it. Tracked it now on one call. That was in the areas. I can't. I can't check no GPS when I'm in handcuffs. So. I don't mean the number one call. Just the general place area that you were driving from, where you uh, repossessed the car and north, where you got stuck. See, I knew this was gonna happen. I, I physically knew this was gonna happen because I specifically said this is not the guy we need to ignore this claim. But it happened anyway. So. Run out of death. So I had called one of my buddies and I'm like, hey, bring me some death. He brought me some death because it's well, well, a road, so I couldn't really drive it unless I had it. So I sat on the side of the life debate, and then that's when the dude's son came up and was like, oh, you're still in my dad's truck. And I'm like, no, I'm not. He didn't pay his fucking bills, so guess what? He's going to get taken. So then that's when I continued down that street that parallels, like, you know, uh, I, don't, I don't even know the fuck. Oh, Saint. Same Vitus Boulevard or whatever, like this street that's right here that goes all the way down. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm looking the wrong way. Howick, Howick Avenue. No, it goes all the way down. I came down Howick, then I came, took a right, and then I came in here because I had to drop off the orange truck in here and then drop the other one down at the docks. Thank you very much for your honesty, sir. One second, I'm just going to call up my, my guy. Oh, what the so. fuck? Here, you put forward so you can finish doing yeah. your job while I just sit here. Yeah, uh, 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 you can let him out of cuffs, officer. Alright. So I've been detained by myself as well, by the, uh, as whatever this officer is, but uh, once I got this sorted, you'll be free to go. From what I can say, it sounds like a conflict of intelligence. Yeah, very much. Hey. Oh, thing, I'm yeah, I'm gonna send you something I need to verify with CCTV. Your plate is gonna be Bravo, uh, Idaho, George, Delta, 117. Uh, it's gonna be towing two trucks. 500, I've got ladders where I am. Pick them up. Oh, hold on. Is it two fifty or three fifty? We have three fifty. It brings valve for both trucks. All right, you can have this clipboard back. Alrighty. Yeah, five, so, five, five, ten, now that I see that's all legit, um, I'm gonna have to give the, uh, the complainant a call and said that he, uh, basically had his trucks repossessed, so, but the way it sounded like, the, w the way that he described it made it seem like you got, you just picked him up and just stole him, so. Well, that's because it was his son that called him, and he's probably not nowhere around, and his son was trying to chase me down, I just kept driving. Oh, gotcha. All right, let me uh, let me go ahead and call this guy and let him know that his vehicles have been repossessed. All right, thank you. No problem. Hello. Hey, this is Officer Corley with the Los Angeles Police Department. How you doing? Hey, not Abe. So I spoke with you uh, earlier about the uh, about the truck. Had a bystander tell me that. Well, the trucks, the yes. Well, I didn't realize the other truck was stolen. You you only specified on the uh, on your orange Harley there. So, from the from the guy that sp supposedly stole them, um, so they're actually part of a repossessed uh, statue. Yeah, the guy uh, the guy said that you didn't pay your uh, your customizations or something something with the bank. Um, I can't rule on that. You know, if it's a repossessed job, he has to do his job. He has to take the cars by any means necessary. So. Whether it's, you know, he's got the keys to them or loads them up on the flatbed and takes them away. But, you know, I can't, I can't say for that. But, um, listen. Yeah, no, look, I understand that you're, you're upset, but he's got a job to do. All right, he repossessed the cars, both the green one and the orange and black one. He did not steal them. 
uh, as your son, as far as I heard, claim. Mm -hmm. Well, you, that's that's gonna have to be with the bank or whatever, where, wherever you bought the modifications or where, whatever you need to do. I cannot go forward with that. That's not on me. That's on you. Okay. If if you have to pay with the bank or pay with the modifications or the company that made the the, the mods, whatever, you, you have to do that civilly. Okay. That's that has nothing to do with me. That's a that's a guy taking your cars because you didn't pay for whatever. All right. That has nothing to do with me. That's a civil issue. If you want to bring it to the courthouse, you're more than welcome. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'm sorry to give you the hey, this information, here, uh, sir, but unfortunately, that's that's, that's where it's got to be. Yep. Eight, five, seven. Well, I, I, um, he's not being placed under arrest. He's got a job to do. He's got the paperwork. He just, I validated everything. So, I again, I understand you're upset, but on there's the nothing vehicle. I can do. It's part of repossession. All right. All right, you're more than welcome to contact the courts. I mean, look, if you want to contact my supervisor, you can call the station. All right, I'm not going to go back down there and bring you a supervisor. I understand you're upset. All right. It's a mail on All right. the bike. All right, take care. So can I speak to you over here a second? Oh, my God. But that's a grove in the cold You're not in trouble. Uh, I, you just didn't hear me earlier since you went out of your head, but I'm just letting you know, apologize for the inconvenience of what happened. You understand that with my job and the stuff that I was investigating, yeah, yeah, I've got to come in heavy. Yeah, yeah. I apologize if I upset or offend you know, that you guys don't let me step on your toes. I get that. But obviously, I, I was just acting on the intelligence yeah. I had, and obviously because of the pursuit and shit, I didn't hear what was going on. So I apologize for uh, ruining what I was going on here, and I hope you guys have a good day. Especially you, officer. I didn't mean to uh, run up and into. No, you're scene. good. I w I heard. I kind of had the feeling in my head that I was like, well, this guy just said over the radio that my suspect, who isn't a suspect, who did kill an officer, <laughs> is they're that they're on the way. So. <laughs> well, I appreciate you guys uh, having patience with me rather than just uh, stonewalling me. But uh, yeah, I'll leave you guys to it. Have well, a good night. Take care. Alright, and uh, with that, sir, so I let the guy know that uh, you supposedly sold the cars from. Um, so he he has understood. He was pretty upset, by the way. He uh, wanted my supervisor and you to take his cars back, but whatever. Well, there's nothing I can do because you're just doing your job, so. Exactly. We're both just doing our mm -hmm. So you're all set. You're free to go. Do what you gotta do, man. Uh, it was the two people in the Take side They were being shot at. Those are the people I called out. What's their description? And description. One is a whiskey mic wearing a tan vest. No all right. Undershirt. And the other one after is all a that, we are back in service. They're with me right now. So a male wearing a black pants and a red puffer jacket isn't involved. 